What's up, YouTubers? Uh, Russ Navarra here. I just wanted to kind of remind you that we've got a, a long weekend coming up here. Um, you know, I know I haven't done a video in a while. Um, and I just wanted to uh, tell everybody uh, to be prepared uh, for anything. Um, uh, I'm noticing Antifa and a lot of these others, um, you've got the Clintons, you've got Obama, you've got uh, all these people that are trying to go against Trump. Um, I'm just telling you to be prepared. Um, we live in a society right now that, um, and people's not noticing it, <clears throat> but um you know, they could do a false flag. Um, they really want to take your freedom. And what better way to do it is on the 4th of July. Um, and it, we've got a long 4th here coming up. Um, I know they're getting a lot of people to the border trying to uh, start something there. They would love nothing more to do is to get us distracted or get us in a civil war um things are getting down to the wire they're 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 fighting for their power to um you know to be in control that they've they've totally lost their minds i think um you know there's a lot of different uh things out there that you could notice that that's happening and um like i said what better way to uh, take away our freedom and things is on the fourth of J july especially with a long weekend like this and so all i'm saying is be prepared um you know get get your stuff um ready and uh, yeah just have everything ready uh, have your bug out bag ready to go with the stuff, uh, have plenty of water, uh, check your weapons out, get them cleaned up, um, just get them locked and loaded, um, I'm not saying that, you know, we need to, um, you know, we just need to be prepared, you know, um, a lot of things can, can escalate, um, you know, and, and I don't think any of our um, what do I want to say, uh, patriots, uh, I don't think they would start anything, uh, don't start anything, just be prepared, be ready, um, like I said, be locked and loaded, um, more than likely they're going to try something to where they're going to be the ones that, uh, is going to start, start the, uh, civil war, um, I don't know why I keep saying that. Uh, I think there's other powers that is out there that's not going to let it happen. Um, you know, there, there's too many patriots. There's too many uh, other aspects that I, I don't think it's going to happen. It's just I'm telling you to be prepared. Don't uh, don't sit back anymore and say, well, I'll leave it up to this guy or I'm going to leave it up to that guy. Um, just uh, for all you preppers out there and things, um, you know, I don't know why I'm getting this a bad vibe, bad feeling. Um, it, you know, just be prepared, get your food, get your water, um, have an, a plan of action um, because we as patriots may have to stand up, you know, to these people uh, for our freedom. And, you know, there's a lot of people out there that don't believe that. Um, but I'm telling you, um, from some of the stuff I've been reading and watching and things like that, um, you know, things are not, you know, this is their last stand. They're, they're losing total control of everything. And, you know, they don't want that. And I know Obama and Hillary is behind a lot of this, um, they would love to see nothing but anarchy, um, that to where they could have Obama come back in, take over uh, the UN, um, and get their uh, one world order. And that's the whole thing. They're losing 
total control of their One World Order. And uh, I think it's going to be a last-ditch effort, effort, excuse me. Um, if not, they'll try it uh, other ways, but I think this is one of them deals where they want to, um, I just get a bad feeling that they want to do another 9-11 or they want to create a, you know, false flag. Um, they would like to blame it on the, the gun-toting uh, all-American uh, guys like me and, and some of you guys out there, but it, it's not going to work. Um, and they're, I know they're getting a bunch of them down towards the border and trying to create... Um, you know, havoc there. They would love to see a, a influx of um, illegal aliens come in this country. And if you, uh, my opinion is, is just help the law enforcement and things. Um, it, it's it's not pretty. Um, and the vibes I'm getting and things that that you know, um, you know, we need to stand up for this nation. Uh, we still are free, uh, but just keep an eye out this 4th of July. Um, I don't know why that I think this has, you know, um, it may be because it's a, a long 4th and they, you know, that's when they like to do things. Uh, they know people can't get to the banks. They know people um, are going to be more focused on... Uh, firecrackers and blowing up things and um, you know they, they would like to start total anarchy um, and that's way Antifa and all of them are that they're they're trying to provoke uh, violence and stuff and they're the true terrorist um, but you know people can't see that um, and that's why I thought I'd put this video out you know, once again I said I'd use my platform for um, what I choose, and this is one of the things that's near and dear to my heart that I think, um, you know, we all need to stop and take a look. Um, but preppers, be prepared for anything. Um, and thank you for listening. And I forgot um, one other thing I would like to uh, thank um, Scott Peterson. Um, let me get one of his deals off here. Uh, Scott sent me a magnet. Um, this is his magnet. I don't know if you can see it very well. There's not a whole lot of light. Let me turn some light on here. Put this down. I don't know if that'll help. But thanks again, Scott. It's probably backwards. Um... I appreciate the, you know, I was surprised getting it in the mail, which um, I was tickled that, that you'd sent, sent me a sticker. But thanks again, Scott. Um, I do appreciate it. I appreciate anybody and everybody that does uh, send me stickers and things. And I'm getting, you know, a variety of them. Um, and I appreciate each and every one of you that send me stickers and, and all my subscribers and things. And, um, you know, that's that's the main thing is we all just need to stick together as a, uh, a group. Um, and hopefully, you know, we can stick together and get through. Um, we're living in a very cynical world now and you know it just um i don't know it's just um i've had a bad feeling for a while um i haven't done a whole lot of videos uh, i was gonna do some but I, i'm almost to the uh to the point where i've told uh everybody that i can tell i've reached out to the people that matter um you know the, uh, you know, we're in a time that, that now we're going to have to take sides, I think. And, you know, I truly believe you need to be ready, prepared. Um, 
and uh, just be uh, aware of your surroundings. Uh, you know, I know a lot of people um, probably disagree with me. Um, you know, there there's a lot going on. Uh, you know, I'm not giving up on humanity. Uh, I think there's power, uh, a higher power, I'll put it that way, and maybe that's why he's guiding me on some things. Um, you know, there there's a lot of stuff that I see that that's for the good, uh, and that's why we need to stay positive. Don't you know? Don't let these thugs and things get away with you know trying to ruin you know what our ancestors uh, had uh, had in store for us, and I, I think we're going to come into a a uh, time in our lives where we're all going to be enlightened a lot more. We're going to see a lot more and we're going to see through these uh, what I call thugs or, or you know, no accounts. Uh, you know, they're, they're, they're fighting for their power because they've lost it. And Mr. Trump is, uh, you know, he started the, the uh, space deal. Uh, I could go in more in that, but, uh, you know, I want to focus on, on this more than anything. But, but we're all going to see some things change, and it's going to be for the good. Um, and, you know, uh, I know there's technology out there now that we could have free energy. We could have, but once again, it all has to do with control. They want to control you, and as long as you let them control you, uh, they win. Um, if you uh, control them and stand, start standing up for, for things, I think we're all going to be enlightened. We're all going to go to a higher level. Um, we're a lot more intelligent than what they are. Uh, like I said, they're a bunch of thugs and hooligans, and you know we we have the the power to uh, defeat them because uh, we've got God on our side, um, you know, and we know who wins in the end. And you know we've got that higher power, that higher we have the the ability to um, destroy them, and that's that's what they're worried about. They're running scared. And they're going to do anything and everything to uh, try to get their uh, new world order in. And, and they've about lost it. Um, and I see some of them that are are scared and, and that. And they, they well should be because um, they're going to be destroyed. And, you know, um, they're going to suffer the consequences. Uh, and I think it's going to be a consequence that... Uh, they 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 have no faction, you know. They think that you know they're not going to suffer, but they've made others suffer. So I believe uh, they're definitely going to suffer. Um, I've said a lot today. I've talked a little too much, a little maybe let a little too much out. Um, you know, uh, just like, share, comment. Uh, once again, love one another. Uh, be kind to one another. Uh, that's the main thing. And we will see you in the next video. Thanks again. Once again, Scott, I appreciate it. Um, and I love all of my subscribers out there. And may God uh, bless you and look over you. And hopefully we will see you in the next video. And yeah. Have a, a blessed fourth, and, you know, hopefully uh, everything is is going to turn out. Uh, so, have a, uh, a good fourth.